and uh, copy the image to your SD card for the Raspberry Pi on a Mac computer which it's pretty uh, easy we'll just go to the raspberrypi.org slash downloads uh, website here and we can download their uh, imager for uh, Mac OS so you can just download that and install it which I'm sure if you're using a Mac you know how to do that so we're just going to go ahead and we're just going to click on these images here for Raspbian <clears throat> so as you can see we have the most updated ones here desktop with recommended software desktop with limited software and the light version as you can see the different file sizes and this is these are zips so once they're extracted they will be a lot bigger so you could just pick whatever one you feel I went ahead and already downloaded it to save some time but you can just click on the zip or if you like using torrent your choice so what we are going to do once you have your imager installed we can come up here we'll choose uh, the first tab there we'll get down here to erase and we'll click on SD card which I might have to receipt mine <clears throat> just ignore that so as you can see here it is so we'll just select it and we're just going to go ahead and write it so it'll uh, erase everything on the card so obviously make sure you select the right one you don't want to uh, format your hard drive or the wrong SD card if you have multiple ones plugged in so once we are done with that we can go ahead and click on the tab there for operating system we're going to go ahead and select use custom IMG and once you download this to whatever folder normally if you download it it goes to the download folder but I just made it uh, folder here on the computer for the purpose of this video and drug it in so once it's downloaded as you can see we downloaded this uh, file here and it's a zip so we'll just highlight it and all you need to do is right click on it and uh, click uh, let me pull it up here so if we go here there we go to image if you right click on it you'll see open you can just click open then it'll extract it over to the IMG so once we're done with that we'll just go ahead and select the IMG and hit open so now that we have that selected we're going to click on this and make sure you click on the right uh, SD card and we're just going to click right now it may come up ask you for a password if you have your computer set up that way or whatnot <clears throat> and the SD card I'm using is not the fastest for uh, writing but reading it's not bad at all but uh, so this is going to take a little bit of time but we're not going to stay here and wait on it so once this is done you should be good to go to uh, eject it and put it in your uh, Raspberry Pi so this is one way to uh, upload the uh, image to the SD card without using terminal if you don't feel comfortable using terminal you will either use a GUI uh, this way it's probably a lot safer if you're just getting started into the uh, Linux environment and uh, using a terminal so you have less chance of uh, formatting the wrong drive so hopefully this helps out it's nice that uh, Raspberry Pi came out with an imager a little while back so you can uh, download both here from the same page and you should be good to go so thanks for watching stay tuned for another one don't forget to hit the like share and subscribe button and I'll be back.